Welcome back to my show. I'm the Beard Venturer. I'm Carissa. And on this episode, happy holidays. It's holiday beer time. And this one is Office Party from Abita down there in Louisiana. This is a 6.8% stout. So we're ready for the holidays. Get you some strong stouts. And it's been a really long time since I had one of these, so I don't exactly know what I'm getting myself into. I'm not sure if I've ever had one. I don't, no, I, so. I don't know. He's dark. Yes. He's dark. Oh, look at that dark head. Dark and lovely. God, dog. So, Carissa really likes the stouts. So, I decided to give her this one over uh, some of my other co hosts right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, uh, spice up your holiday mix and mingle with this best dressed brew. It smells good. Office Party is a holiday stout brewed with oats, yes. Pale caramel and chocolate malts, yes. And mm -hmm. hopped with Willamette hops, yeah. Generous amounts of cocoa nibs, cinnamon, vanilla, and nutmeg are added to infuse the spirit of the holidays. What? What? So it's gonna be an oatmeal stout, yeah. Because the oats and Willamette's usually pretty, uh, pretty much. Oh my word! Yeah, the smell, fantastic. golly. Good. Okay. Started off with the glaring problem. I swear it's right up here at the top. Limited release. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I drink this year round. Mm -hmm. It's a yeah. chocolate oatmeal stout with a little bit of cinnamon and nutmeg, man. And not very much cinnamon and nutmeg. No. I would have actually liked a little bit more, to be honest with you, just because it's a Christmas beer. But it's good. I can see that, but there's not enough cinnamon in it. Not me. I need more. I need more Christmas in my beer. Wow, the tiara's gotten to you. <laughs> uh, the mouthfeel is like super good. Mm -hmm. um, that's from what I what I would assume is going to come from the oatmeal. I didn't see anything about it being like a milk stout too and it doesn't drink no, like a milk stout. it doesn't drink like a milk stout. Um, that wouldn't be good too. Yeah. Um, that might have might have helped the other stuff come to the front too. I'm actually feeling a little more of the cinnamon and nutmeg now. But it's not a whole lot. Mm -mm. Um, but it's not like overly chocolatey either. And it says no, that cocoa really nib. Not. It's just like really well. I would say it's really well rounded. And mm -hmm. I think uh, a lot of people's, especially the holiday stouts, usually have one thing that's a little over, like over. Yeah. Uh, like it'll be. Uh, a lot of times it tends to be like either. A cinnamon or a clove or something like that that mm -hmm. that tends to be the standout flavor and this one is super super balanced yeah uh, doesn't drink like a 6-8 either no not really I would be interested to know if this is a standalone stout that for, to make it office party they like added the yeah so the the other little thing. I got just a little bit of vanilla that time. I did too. Just uh, a little. I think it's gonna be one of those that it really needs to warm up. Warm up. Mm. Um, you might. Most, most stouts are. I did just get this one right out of the fridge. As not bad. If you've watched a lot of our stout videos, they are generally better after they've sat for a few minutes. You get all those notes come out much better when they're a little warmer now i'm trying this season 
the end of 2022 to do more holiday beers. I haven't really done that as much. Um, mm -hmm. Like, if you guys want to see a playlist, I might even try to put a playlist of that together. Um, I've been thinking of doing some more playlists just because, I mean, it might be easier for people to find things. Right. Because I do have over 700 videos. Mm. Yeah. Kind of nice. Oh, it is smelling more and more. Mm. Yeah. I think this is definitely one that you probably got need a little to, more cinnamon that time. You probably need to set this one on the counter for about five or six minutes yep. before you open it. Or just, you know, pour it and let it sit. Let it open up. Yeah. I think this one would be a really good candidate for um, have that liter mug. Mm -hmm. Pour two of them in there, hard pour, so they can kind of open up and it'll warm up as you're drinking it. Mm -hmm. Um Plus, any excuse to use the liter mug is a good one. <laughs> this is for me. That's one of the things I really love about stouts is... They don't get shitty as you drink no, them. No, and they, they just change and morph. And mm -hmm. they're, the, no two drinks of it are the same. And to think when she first started hanging out with me, she was like, I drink vodka and cranberry. <laughs> and I was like, what about beers? And she's like... I don't really like beers, and I was like. What he said was, no, 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 no. You just haven't had the right beer. Yeah. And now you've had some right beers, so. Well, overall, I'm, I'm really, I'm really enjoying this. And uh, I'll have to look in my, on the beer shelf. Don't know if I only got one of these or if I did get the six pack. One. I think, uh, I think I only got one. I need, I need some more. This was good. Uh, Lunchbox would like this too. Mm -hmm. uh, so with Dunbar. Um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying this. Good. And if you guys are enjoying this video, uh, hit me with the like. I mean, it'll be a Christmas present or a present anytime that you watch this. Um, it really helps out. It helps the channel. helps the video. Everything. Oh. Uh, oh. Yeah. It's getting better and better. Oh, um, there's there's the cinnamon, there's the nutmeg. Mm -hmm. So crazy. If if you really enjoy our videos, uh, go ahead and subscribe. It'd be awesome. I'm right about filming this. I'm getting very close to that 1,000 mark. Um, and if you ring the bell, you'll get at least three a week. Uh, sometimes I go ham and put out five or six. Um, just depends on how many videos we've filmed recently. Um, now, you check down there in the description. Uh, I'll find whatever links I can put for my stuff, and I'll find some kind of description for this beer. Give you a little more information. Um, hey, if you guys have some suggestions for holiday beers, Jeez. if you put that down there in the comments, I'd love to talk to you guys. Or if you like this beer, or you know, if there's something you're looking for, hoping that I'll do. Hey, uh, don't just hope. Put it down there. Maybe I can find it. Right. Uh, now, I have already had a couple people post something that is like super, super, super regional. And it's like all the way on the other side of the United States. And I'm going to have a really hard time getting that. But I don't know, man. I'm always asking my friends when they're driving through. Stop and grab me something random. Y'all should do that to your friends, too. Mm -hmm. um, let's get down to it. Did you dig it? More and more. Yeah, I am. Uh, the more... The more it warms up, God, it smells like even more chocolatey now. Mm -hmm. Just smell it. Uh, would you have another? Oh God, it is like I'm gonna go. I'm right gonna now. probably buy a full six pack here later this week, yeah. uh, just to drink these. Uh, I, I'd really like this. I will have some more, just not straight out of the refrigerator. Yeah, I think I do. Yeah, it's gotta, it's gotta kind of warm up. You gotta let this one open up. Um. Is it pick six worthy? Absolutely. Most if you're a stout fan, better get a six. Uh, just go ahead and grab a six of these. Plus, uh, when I find Abitas, they're at a pretty good price for craft mm -hmm. beers. Um, I mean, it's it's not like Miller Lite price, but it's more than Miller Lite. So, you know, you're a six eight stout. Of course, it's going to be more than 
you know, a juggernaut of the industry. Um, just get what you pay for. Right. Um, seekability, limited release. Right. You're kind of stuck Say with so. that. Go ahead and grab you a handful of them. In case of some rational amount. <laughs> to work. away. Yeah. Um, I do that with some things. Um, now, on my scale of one to ten, one's the lowest, ten's the highest. I'm at an eight. Really? Yeah, I'm, I really like this. It goes down super easy. Um, Straight out of the it refrigerator, it was a six, but as it warms up, it's a seven. Um, I I honestly think when I get another six pack and I do my liter mug, um, it's going to be fantastic. Mm. More nutmeg. Yeah, I taste more and more of the stuff in it. Yep. And I'm enjoying it more. The, the more it warms up. So. Mm -hmm. There you go. Well, there you have it. To your next beer adventure. Cheers. Happy holidays.